In Abuja, the federal government has moved to amend the act establishing the Council of Nigerian Mining Engineers and Geoscientists. The essence is to bring the institution at par with global best practices. TVC News correspondent Jokia Desa reports. COMED was established by military decree in 1990 to regulate all professionals and firms in geosciences, mining engineering, and metallurgy in the country. More than 30 years after, the law has not been reviewed. A proposed bill is being formally presented to amend the over 30-year-old law governing the operations of COMEG. This is the last of interactive meetings among stakeholders to harmonize all thoughts on the proposed law. The drafters are optimistic it will be a viable law once signed. It was emphasized that we don't amend so much so that the act will not be repealed entirely and then the process will be dragged. To the stakeholders, open your minds as we sail through the act and at the end of the day, we will have all done justice, not only to this profession, but to our country and to humanity. The council says the goal is to have an enduring law that will stand the test of time. Now, there is no way you can become a mining destination when the regulator is not empowered to do his job. Then you are going to have a lot of illegality in the system. And that will drive us back. Ghana is ahead of us in terms of this. South Africa is ahead of us. We are the big nation in Africa, and we must be able to do it right, and we must get it right. The minister insists an improved COMEG law will contribute to making Nigeria a mining destination. In the 32 years, a lot will have happened that will need adjustments. Hence, this act has looked at the present realities and has made some adjustments. High point of the event was the formal launch of the COMEX scale of professional fees. It becomes unethical for us to supplant our colleagues with pricing. In architecture, if you do that, you can lose your license. The outcome of the interactive meeting on the reviewed COMEG Act will be presented to the Federal Executive Council. The bill will thereafter be sent to the National Assembly for its consideration and passage. Jokia TVC News.